If you need it, he's got it. If you didn't know you need it, well, he's got that too. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Today I am on a new adventure. I am checking out an antique store near my home that Dolores, Miss Dam Jewelry, found when she was here and I didn't even know this place was here. Um, she says this is a really big place, but that it is spendy. So she said it's worth a look. So let's go in and check out antiques and decor. So we're right outside of a busy road, but they do have some beautiful things outside. So I'm going to take a look and I'll probably maybe do a little voiceover, a little music, just because I've never been here and I've been told there's a lot to look at. Holy cow, y'all, this place is packed. Dolores did not lie. So let's just start looking. These are so pretty. All these little bottles. Look at all these glasses, y'all. <gasps> Look at the butterflies. Oh my gosh. This place is packed. Dolores, good call. Good call, girl. We'll see what they got. Look at all of this cobalt. <gasps> Look at that cobalt fairy lamp. Holy cow. Can y'all see that? I think that it is 15. So I might be checking that one out. Oof, that looks good, girls. Girls and guys, this looks so fun. Oh, look at this one. There's a lot of music in the background. This one's 25. They're jamming out in here, that's for sure. So I was walking closer to a radio. I never saw the radio, but the music was blaring over in this corner. Y'all, he has everything and there's just so much to look at. I basically just glanced through this whole store, um, picking up things that kind of caught my eye here and there. A lot of the items are not priced. Some of them are priced, um, but he has some amazing things. I did see some encased glass, but the painting, the hand painting seemed to be missing off of that. And look at those, y'all. Look at those yellow roosters. I don't think that they were salt and peppers. They were just super cute. My good night. Look at all of this jewelry. And I thought I had a lot of jewelry, y'all. Holy crud. <laughs> Oh my word. Look at all of that. Do you see all of this jewelry? I'm flipping out. Look at that one. That one's pretty though. Okay, no jewelry, no jewelry, no jewelry. Holy cow. I think I'm going to go put my purse in the car. All these little bunnies. And there is a cat right here. Yeah, I like that cat right there. He's doing an estate sale. And he's taking all of these to the estate sale. He's already got them pinned up and everything. I bought them like this. <laughs> oh, you did? You bought them like this? So I just like that with them. Like yeah, take it to the estate sale. How fun. Look at all of those. Oh my gosh, my friends would go crazy for all of that. Yeah. And the best part is he said that um, we can film in here. So bringing people, y'all, this place is massively huge, but look at all of that. Jewelry. I'm not gonna ever say I have a lot of jewelry. That's what, that's what I'm not gonna do. I'm not gonna say I have a lot of jewelry. He has a ton of jewelry. Oh my gosh. So this is going to be a fun, fun place. Look at this dog. <laughs> oh, I think that's a palm. I need to ask Christy if that's a Pomeranian. I don't know if it is or not. It's not a white one though. All right, look here, Tammy, Vintage Uprising, Texas. Y'all, we have to, y'all, we're gonna have to come over here. Miss Martha, Tammy, Christy, all the people that's in or close to or visiting Texas, we got to make this one of our spots. Now, right now, his AC is out. 
and it's hot in here. But look at all of this Franciscan. Isn't this Franciscan, the apple pattern? Is that what that is? That's Franciscan apple, isn't it? Y'all tell me in the comments below. I could be wrong about that. Uh, literally, I'm just going around letting y'all see. Oh, clown alert, be alert. They've even got comic books. Clown alert, little bit of clown. Got some Barbies, Barbies in right now. But there is a little bit of everything in this store. And it is pretty massive. Oh, what is this? Van Brickle. Isn't that beautiful? It's 25. Gotta show that to Jerry and Tim of Vintage and Vino because, yeah, they love them some Van Brickle. They even have some real primitive and the African art. He says he does estate sales. Did I already tell y'all that? But, um, they have one coming up this weekend. He said there's not a lot of stuff in the house, but man, he's got the teacups. Definitely got the teacups. If you're looking for some really cool teacups, there they are. Oh, I need Catherine Young. She would be able to help me with the teacups in here. But. Oh my gosh. Look at them all. They're everywhere, y'all. Clear glass. Oh, I like this one. This one is cute. Look at that. That one's cute. It's $10. But he said that maybe he'll work a bundle with me. So we'll have to see. This rose keeps coming up. We keep finding that. Some green luster up there as well. Super cute stuff, y'all. Oh, all these perfume bottles. Look at all of these perfume bottles. Mm, I really like that one. These are like Christmas. We what all of that in there is, don't we? But. He's got some beautiful, oh, there is an old stuff. I bet all of those are briar horses. Holy cow. Furniture. He has got massive furniture too. So yeah, look, that's a cute little pattern. And he's got like whole sets. So apparently he does the, they've got, bless his heart, he's got fans going everywhere. But um, they do the state clean out, like I said, and he must, be the one that recoups that look at look at this right here is that not beautiful I put my purse in the car y'all did I say that already too but I put my purse in the car because I just about knocked over an entire lamp I was like oh my gosh look at all the salt and peppers bunch of salt and peppers these cats go together those are so cute. <gasps> look, y'all. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at her. I don't know what is on her face. I don't think I could get it off. I'm thinking it's gonna be 25 though. Oh, I have to go and ask him about that. Really interesting. I'm guessing this is Westmoreland, but look at how that is striped. Do you see that? Now, I've not seen them that have been striped before. So here's another section where the music was really loud. Y'all, this place is packed. Have I said that? Look at those beautiful birds. And you can open up any of the cabinets, which I thought was really nice. Now, there's a lot of Capitamonte in here. And in the back over there, you see a couple of the Bluebirds of Happiness. It does have a lot of beautiful, beautiful perfume bottles. I mean, there's just eye candy everywhere, just stuff after stuff after stuff but unfortunately it was a hundred and something degrees outside and his air conditioner was broken he did have all his fans going and he did have the doors open it was not totally unbearable but it was hot in there y'all look at all the eggs 
Remember, I'm looking for a little tiny, teeny, tiny plate for my plate wall. Remember like a, um, like a butter pat or something. Oh, I know that's a huge piece of Fenton in there. But this, this has to be, I, I need the name for this. I can't remember, but I need the name for that. But that's very, very pretty. cabinet of pottery. Man. And this that sign too. That's really pretty. So he did say that he would talk to me about prices um, to do a bundle. So that's good. Look at the Right there. So I guess it would have to be this little. I don't know, but I don't need the cup. I just need the saucer. Y'all, there's a whole another section. Holy cow. There is a whole another section. Oh, there's some tins. Look at that Folgers coffee tin. Oh my gosh. Is it, um... I can't remember who collects those now. There is Fol for Forgers. Folgers. For Y'all know I can't say what that word is. So, yeah. There's a whole nother section. Like, this whole room in here. Oh, my goodness. Y'all, we're going to be here all day. Looking at this stuff. I am so impressed with the full collections of dishware and just the sets that he has. I'm about to pan over and show you some of the figurine collections that he has. Y'all are not going to believe this, but this place is amazing. And glass, oh yes, he has glass as well. I think he has everything, y'all. I really do. These Joseph's Originals still have their tags on them. Holy And they don't look like any of them are broken. I think this is so sweet. There's even some babies. Look at that composite little baby. And there's some more babies up there. I recently found some chocolate covered cherry boxes. This box is absolutely amazing. Look how good of shape that box is. A section of idols, like theodos and medium size. Oh my gosh, what do y'all see in there? You see anything we need to look at? These colors stuck out to me. This must be a salt and pepper shaker. It is salt and pepper shaker. He has a ton of stuff in here. Dolores and I will have to come back when she comes to visit again. Has that got fireworks in there? Holy cow. In this heat, I'd be afraid they will go off. Okay, so here's a little but it's like a coaster. And then here's some other littles. I'm looking for about that size, like this size, but I don't know if I want the rim on that. But I like this little plate. That little plate is darling. That's cute. 
All right, keep looking. Yes. Oh, it's a little china tea set. Isn't that darling? And look, there's a planter that is a bowling ball. There's a bunch of littles right here. Y'all, more jewelry. I'm actually looking for a stand like this. It doesn't have a price on it, but I'm looking for a stand like that. I just cannot bring myself to pay the hundreds of dollars that they cost because I actually want to. <laughs> Not being greedy, I just want to. One for each side of the room. So yeah, I guess his air is not working. I don't know, but it is really, really hot in here. But they actually must repair and clean up stuff because they also, we're right on the side of a really busy road. But, oh, look at this. That's wood art. There's probably some really great art down in here, but I don't want to tear anything up while I'm filming and I only have one hand so there's a lot to look at in this place a lot and I need to kind of start picking up some things that I saw because I'm going to forget them and taking them up front for me to ask him about but right now I haven't even been upstairs at all. Let's go upstairs and you can't, he said it's gonna be really hot up here. Look at these. Are these little cats or are they owls? I think they're cats. So apparently they were, they're $22, but they don't have the capacity to meow or whatever. That little bunny is cute. It's a cute little Tanala bunny. I've never seen a little bunny before. That's something to think about. Let me try not to break my leg going up. Is that a donkey? Oh Lord. Is this a donkey? He would have had salt and pepper shakers. I'd love to have him with his salt and pepper shakers. That's for sure. He says it's really hot up here. So he's even got plates on the wall. He's got some horses over here. Okay, I might faint because of the heat, but you know what? You just gotta do it. He did offer me water, y'all. He did offer me some water. He's right. It's really, really hot up here, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. I mean, I'm game if y'all are. So if I pass out, just know that the video will just run until <laughs> somebody finds me. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh, oh. Look at this stuff. This is stuff he has not even processed. He has so much. Hmm. I don't know. Need a chair, need a pillow. I'm not going back there. It's just hot. He does have a ton of fans. I mean, this is like a digger place. It's a cross between a digger place and a just a massive, beautiful, oh Lord, am I gonna fall? Um, he's, oh, I need actually need one of these springs to, I was going to hang jewelry on that, you know, because I thought I had a lot of jewelry. He's got frames. He's got unglazed pottery. Y'all, he got everything. I'm not even going to lie. If you need it, he's got it. If you didn't know you need it. Well, he's got that too. Oh my gosh. Oh Lord. Okay. Almost tripped over my own feet. Yeah. And see, this is the, oh, look how they did the door on the garage though. That's darling. All right, focus. 
got to stay focused up here. Got to stay focused. So I'm guessing that, yes, he does estates and then he does clean out and therefore he needs a place to bring it and sell it. And this is that place. Oh my gosh. Now I know if this was organized up here, he would, he would have so much more selling place. Oh my gosh, huge fan, sorry. bottles, silver plate, oh, what is that, the old Quaker bottle, what is that one, yeah, that's an old Quaker bottle, green bottles, brown bottles, bottles they dug up, holy Toledo, holy cheese and crackers, girl, I know you hot right here, I know you are hot, child, I bet that glows. He just doesn't even know what he, there's no way to know everything that is up here. He's super nice. This is the nicest man. And he has a bunch of stuff. Look, if you need extra fondue forks, he's got it. I told you, I'm trying to think of something that I look for or that people ask about or anything like that. Um, I, I am trying to think of stuff, but y'all, I, other than butter pats, which he probably has, and I just haven't seen them. I really, really, really want to dig in this. I really do. I really, really do. He's got all kinds in here. Dragonware. Oh, starting to sweat upside down teddy bears all right i don't even know if y'all got to see me digging in that but that was something i have my black light with me but anybody want to take bets on if that glows it is flash though so maybe it does not see it is flash maybe it does not maybe i stand corrected girl i know you burning up too right there miss abc oh, -wee. it is hot he is the nicest gentleman I actually don't remember what he told me his name was because I was so focused on the fact that I'm hot. But y'all, I got some great items. Um, I will show them to you when I get home. But I did um, ask him if it would be okay if I went back in and kind of when the air conditioner got fixed, uh, did a whole little video um, on his store. It is a great place to stop. Now, it is pricey, some of it, and um, it is marked um, higher, but he is willing to bundle, and I got everything that I'm going to show you in just a few minutes for just $30 because he said it was my first time in the store. So, I enjoyed the shop along um, through this wonderful little antique store that Dolores sent me to in Stafford, Texas. Then go ahead and give the video a, a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you're not already part of my YouTube family. I'd love for you to join me. And don't forget the notification bell. Select all so you never miss a video upload or a live event so hang tight y'all because my very small haul for $30 is coming up next hey y'all so I'm back home and as promised I'm gonna turn the camera around and I'm gonna show you the few things I picked up in the little antique shop so here we have unwrapped everything um, but I did pick up the cobalt blue fairy lamp that is in excellent condition now i don't know the make or the designer of this so if you do please leave me a comment below i did pick up the little red uh ruby red pixie now i do know that she's broken but i believe that i'm gonna put a little christmas something right here like some tinsel holly and berry maybe a little ornament or something. Now she had a whole bunch of the dirt that is on this one, but he just washed it off just to make sure that it wouldn't affect the cold paint. And that's actually not cold painted. Um, it just rinsed off. So I did also get this little Halloween one. 
She is so cute. And I'm going to wash that up. I'll put a picture once I wash it. I'll put a picture right here. All right, the next thing that I got, I just got like five or six things, um, was this beautiful little Tonala rabbit. Now, I've never seen a rabbit before, and the best thing about this is that it's marked K-E, Ken Edwards, um, and it has the Tonala piece. There's a little chip right there on the bottom, but the rabbit itself is not in any kind of damaged way. So that is really pretty. And the last thing that I picked up was the Wedding Vase Van Briggle piece. Um, and that is like a blue, that's black and blue. That is just beautiful, no chips or cracks. And there is the Van Briggle Colorado Springs mark on the bottom. So I thought this was a really great little haul. Well, that's it y'all, that's all I got, but I thought that that was a pretty good little pickup. Now he did give me a bundle deal, like I said, because it was my first time in there and the air conditioner is broken. So, so again, thanks so much for watching and until next time, y'all stay pretty and be sweet. Bye-bye.